This is a redneck redo. Oh, my wife brought me home a figure. She said, I got you a Ninja Turtle. And when I saw Marvel, like, I don't think Marvel makes Ninja Turtles. Is, uh, Ninja Turtles isn't a Marvel thing. And uh, taking a look at this, this is a damn frog. And hell, it even says Marvel's frog, man. I don't know what the hell she's talking about. It's not a bad figure. Shit, and it was on sale, I guess. But I'll let her think that everything's good because she was so happy. She thought she got me something great. It probably is something great, but I think what I'm going to do with it I'm going to pop his head off, and uh, hopefully the head comes off. Shit. I mean, I'm not going to grind it off, so hopefully. I've actually never tried one of these damn Marvel engines. I hope the damn parts come off, because I was thinking about putting a different head from an old Punisher figure I had and making it look a little overweight, as you can see this person is, or this little figure is, and making him look like Doc Ock, changing it into a Dr. Octopus figure so that's what i'm gonna do with it i'm not gonna open it because this thing has been taped up because i think it, the box got smashed which hell if you want to you know walmart i think that's where my wife got it walmart wants to sell figures that are totally intact and fine for ten dollars just because the box is smashed shit i'll i'll buy one from you every time she got me another one too that i'll do another review of i'm gonna say 10 for 10 because i, I don't know who the hell Frogman is and maybe i'm not much of comic book expert i mean i collected a shitload of comics as a kid i don't remember frog man but uh, the thing about it is i'm gonna give 10 for 10 because i am actually going to be able to turn this into a pretty badass figure when i repaint it and change the the top part of him because i'm i'm more than certain i can make sure this turns out like a doc ock figure and, uh, and i got some other supplies and stuff so as far as what I'm going to do with it, I have to give it a 10 for 10 because I know it's already going to look badass because I already put some of the stuff together to, to make it happen, to change him up, and uh, this is going to be incredible. So, 10 for 10, plus I could give a rat's ass about the box. I mean, sometimes I, I turn the box into a diorama, but I could still actually do that even though it's a little messed up. But shit, I'll always buy figures that are fine but the box is bad holy hell i could care less so anyways i know people collect mint figures and that's kind of why they want the box to be good but i'm going to keep this thing in the damn box i'm going to put them up on my shelf cl crawling through the walls like a damn spider-man villain i'm going to turn them into so anyways here to review